Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about resolving if you're having an issue when attempting to reset your PC and it appears to be stuck on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I would recommend doing is just give it some time. Please be patient. There are so many people that just are not patient enough into waiting. It can take a couple hours potentially to actually reset your computer. So if it doesn't work immediately within like one or two minutes, just give it some time. Come back in a couple hours, maybe three hours tops generally. It shouldn't take more than that. And see if that has then resolved the problem. If you're still having a problem, which I would recommend really just waiting and trying to let it finish, would be just to do a hard power off of your computer. So then just turn it off right on the, the power button. So hold it down, shut off the computer, and then turn it back on. And then you would come back into Windows here, and you would open up the search menu. Type in CMD, best match, should come back with command prompt. Right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now you want to go ahead and type in SFC, followed by a space, forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so once that's done, type in chk, dsk, space, forward slash, r. Again, exactly how you see it on my screen. Hit enter. So it should come back. The type of this file system is NTFS. Cannot lock current drive. Check this cannot run because the volume isn't used by another process. Would you like to schedule this volume to be checked the next time the system restarts? Tap the Y key on your keyboard. Hit enter. And now you will need to save and close out of any open programs and applications and proceed to restart your computer. So it'll prompt you if you want to skip the disk checking, press any key. Do not press any keys on your keyboard. I'm going to because this scan could take quite a while to run, upwards of a half hour to an hour or a couple hours in some cases, depending on how large your hard drive is. But pretty straightforward process. Once it's done, I would attempt the reset utility again and see if that resolves the problem. You can also consider trying a system restore as well if you have any restore points saved on your computer and attempt to restore your computer back to an earlier time. So that's kind of an alternative to resetting your computer as well. And I would recommend trying that before you have to reset your computer anyway, unless you're going back to factory settings, like you're selling your computer or giving it away to someone else, in which case I could understand why you don't want to just do a simple system restore. But Pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.